Greetings, gamers. We are back. Uh, this is episode four of the Laser Core. We are still TV going. Saga. It might it might never end. It we might don't know. not. If these views are good, it might yeah, never end. We'll see. Uh, <laughs> I'm down. I like my character. Yes. I like my character. Uh, back with That's us we have monk. Wes as Sky Pembroke. <laughs> she learned nothing. Myself as Krulax. <laughs> Our, our DM, Jovenshire, over here. Mari is playing Kaiser Sose. No, I'm sorry, Kaizen. <laughs> Kaizen Sose. I know her name, it's Kaizen Voldra. Yeah. Voldra. Uh, Deborah Mustard is of played course. by Noah, Thank uh, you. The, our gnome, of course. And when we last left our, off, uh, we had just escaped the mine of Kelzenad, which had some very uh, not fun things in it. Uh, Rip Bulax. Yeah. But also, Bulax if you haven't seen the previous episode, uh, go ahead and th there's a link in the description. You'll want to catch up. Uh, but dropping back into this episode, Joven RDM is going to take us away. So uh, you had left the the old man wizard in the in the forest, which some of you are just some bad people. We yeah. didn't get to kill Curious. him. When I control Curious. karma Curious. and fate, maybe it'll come around to bite you in the ass. Neutral evil. Whoa, whoa! whoa. You're into karma all yeah. of a sudden. Something's Who gonna come DM? and get karma if karma's coming. <laughs> That's right. right? Uh, That's right. But since then, you've traveled through the forest. As the map that you have mm -hmm. indicates, that on the other side of the forest is uh, the temple that you are looking for in your adventures towards out of the, the forest. Yes, it's taken a day or two to get through it. Uh, you've not been bugged by any more soldiers. Or scorpions. Or scorpions, or Garys, unfortunately. Oh, Gary! Oh, Gary. Oh, Gary! I hope Garys So wait, we haven't seen, we've seen, we've seen no sign of Garys since seen the no encounter. Sign of Gary. Oh man, I hope those hooded figures didn't do anything terrible to You know, to I should have thought ahead, and I should have put <laughs> some Gary sort of tracker. Oh, if they did anything to Jimmy him, we are gonna kill oh, them. Oh, well, that'll be our next mission yes. after we return this horn to figure out what happened to Gary, and if he was wrong, we will hunt down whoever messed with him. That's right, those rogue people. Those Hugh Hefners. <laughs> <laughs> so in your journeys, uh, you actually make it to the uh, outskirts of this forest. You are all healed up. You have your your, your abilities that you can reuse again. Mm -hmm. Keep in mind, some characters can only use it once. So using it on the small <laughs> scorpion that you see, maybe you don't mm -hmm. need to. I could have used it on the big one. You could have used it on the wizard. Oh my gosh, and I could have made him give us both the treasures. I could have told the wizard to give us all the yep. treasure. Uh -huh. Oh. You know what, let's move on. It's been two days, it's been two days. We uh, forgot about it. Hindsight. Actually, uh, as, as you exit the forest and there's, there's a clearing, the trees look wilder. There just hasn't been any way. You can tell that no one's walked this way. This is not a normal path you had actually get through the forest. Um, uh, you made some friends with squirrels along the way, <laughs> and uh, yes. but now you've exited this forest, and in front of you, you see this giant temple, um, and it's Ooh. it's made of like stone and sandstone. It, it looks like kind of like um, the pyramids of Machu Picchu, kind of like okay. that layered effect to it. Okay. Oh. okay. Neat. So, uh, and as you walk up, it is very clear that this is the entrance. Uh, and you see two separate entrances. I know that I do, and I've yet to use it. I know we can all see in the dark, but I know for a fact that I have a torch in my kit and I also have a fire starter. Um, can I, do you guys mind if I were to light a torch? Sure, I would like to uh, light a torch and I would <clears throat> like to use my mage hand to float 30 feet into the left entrance and drop the torch, hopefully providing enough light for our dark vision to see further. Ooh. So. I would like to bring my torch with my hand into the left entrance 30 feet down, drop the torch and see what I see. In the okay. Entrance. As you move oh, closer yes, to the yes. entrances, uh, lights do seem to turn on. Um, oh. it, the the mag uh, the lights are of magic uh, origins, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so they're almost like torches. Mm -hmm. That just like the light that would be coming from a torch is kind of like that just emits from different sections of the wall. Oh, okay. So, but you've dropped My this torch, kind of and um, what you can see is that you have a uh, a bridge that goes across, and the the steps on it. Kind of like, you know when you're playing Minecraft and you're making a bridge, it's it's like all together. It's not like a, a, a bridge with um, wood paneling, but it's just like, you know, these these blocks Still of stones. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that, that are there. And then you can look over the sides and you see that there's at, below these are spikes. I think we should take the other entrance. Yes. I think that one is obviously a false floor. And when we step on it, it might make us fall into the spikes. But that's my thoughts. That's, mm. that's the left path. We don't know what's down the right path. 
Okay. Would Perhaps. you care to yeah, walk Yeah, let's, let's do the not trapped path then. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, I'll light another torch. Can I, uh, can I make a perception check? Are there like footprints going out of me in there? No, no footprints. No, no, no one's been here. You saw because based on the wilderness around you, uh, nothing, none of the nature has been touched at all. So it's safe to say you were the first ones here. Is Deborah able to light the torch again and put it into the other side? Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. I'll yeah. light the torch and I will take my hand down 30 feet down you, the right you, you walk over to the other side. The it has thing. the same lights on the wall, so it's just another mm -hmm. torch that mm -hmm. you've dropped on the floor. Mm -hmm. um, and the same type of bridge with spikes down below. Wow. Oh. All right, I'm 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 not making the choice. Oh, Actually, right or left. Yeah, both someone else bridge. is gonna make the choice. Let's go right. Let's just run quickly across the bridge. <laughs> I have acrobatics. I've got no... Yeah. I'm fault in trying to jump. I have acrobatics I too. Is there anything above well, plus the, the bridge Athletics. at all? Um, looking up, you... Because remember, the it's layered. Mm -hmm. So looking up, you're just kind of seeing at this first level. So you don't oh, see okay. much up there. Okay, okay. Uh, all right, so you guys are going down right the right side. Right side. I'll lead the way. Are there any animals around? Oh, you can do a nature check. Also, you're at the end of the forest. Maybe you 16? might want to check for potions. Yeah, yeah take that. <laughs> Sounds like a baby Grulex out there somewhere. Oh, <laughs> baby uh, 16 on the nature check. So uh, looking for potentially animals and also helpful plants. Uh, yeah, a squirrel walks up to you. And uh, I'll give you enough stuff to make two more potions. Okay. Ooh, can you communicate with the squirrel? Because if not, I can speak to squirrel. He can speak to the squirrel. I can. Oh, okay. Hello, little creature. How are you? Chugga, chugga, chugga. <laughs> Sorry, that's you. you no, no, you, you do that. I'll translate. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Chugga, 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 chugga. Good. Uh, <laughs> have you seen any interesting activity around this area? No. Maybe for nuts, chugga, chugga. I can tell you what chugga, I've seen. Chugga, chugga, chugga. Hmm. I not have any nuts on me, do I? Then I see nothing. Chugga, chugga. Okay. Have a good day, little squirrel. Chugga, All right, thank you. <laughs> he runs off. Man. Okay. Squirrels are running a racket out here. <laughs> <laughs> let's head in. Let's get this horn and get out of here. I want my 10,000 gold. All right. So I head in and I start crossing the bridge. You're crossing the bridge. Uh, well. Run for athletics. Oh, oh, boy. Now You're remember, the it, there's like two, the, there's the, the length for two people. So you're just seeing square, 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 eight, square. But square. my athletics says plus five. Does it? So 13. Athletics plus okay, five. Okay, yeah. Um, oh, because I have proficient in this, so plus strength. All right, roll, so 13. roll a d6 for me. Three. Okay, you've made it three spots, uh, and you walked in a row. Uh, so these two are starting to crumble. Hmm. They're still there, but they're starting to crumble. I knew we were okay. getting some Mario-ish. I'll cast jump on... Uh, uh, the first two steps have fallen through. I'm, I'm going to cast jump on... Uh, on, on Mari, and then I'm going to. Okay. Uh, I'm going to. I begin... really try to get you away from that one, but okay. Yeah, I'm going to begin running, uh, and if uh, one of the platforms falls out from me, I am ready to use my whip to. Okay. Uh, roll athletics. Twelve. Twelve. All right. Roll a d6. Three. All right. You make it right next to uh, to laser corn. Your floor starts to uh, crumble under you. Roll uh, acrobatics. 20. Natural 20. All right, you uh, you just kind of front flip, use your uh, elf lightness to kind of be on top of it, and you're, you're fine at the moment. Can I hop on your shoulders before you jump? You sure can. All right, I'm gonna get on your shoulders because you got super jump. When you hit the arc of your jump, I'm gonna go off of your shoulders and attempt to vault all the way to the other side with my acrobatics. Okay. Okay. That's kind of cool. Wait, he said he wanted us to move together though. We, yeah, 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 it's all happening it's all at the same thing. time. She's okay, got yeah. super jump. She's got to do something. I'm just trying to jump off her shoulders. All right, what am I rolling for? Uh, acrobatics that, that's, or? Uh, acrobatics. 18, 20. Okay, uh, uh, you're half elf? No, I you are elf. I full elf. Full elf, all right, so that means you can jump. So at 12 feet, go you're, ahead and give me an a, a acrobatics check. Uh, acrobatics check, I'm trying to hop three feet. 17 plus 320. Okay, you've made it across. Okay. So as you land, uh, you made it across. As you land, because of force, you are an elf. Uh, go ahead and do a, roll a d20 for me. We're gonna do a, uh, a strength save, actually. 19 plus three. Oh, god damn it, all right. <laughs> yeah. uh, you land softly. Ooh, uh, ooh, like a fan. All right, monk. to my heavier individuals. <laughs> the monk. Uh, my first, yeah, so thick. you're only three feet across, 15 feet. Okay. So there's 15 other planks on this bridge? Uh, 12 more planks. 12 more planks. I guess I just run and try and get across them. Yeah. 11. Okay. Plus, uh, what, what now do I roll modify? your d6. 
Four. Four, all right, you make it four steps. And, ooh, uh, one of them, uh, your last step actually starts to fall through. Uh huh. So go ahead and do an acrobatics check. 15. 15, you made it through. Woo! Okay, you're still standing. I have uh, the cartwheels. Wow. Right, the cartwheel and dwarf. <laughs> you use your bowler. Relax, yeah. All right, uh, continue running. Okay. Just run for the. Uh, 15. Okay, damn it. All right, good. Uh, <laughs> damn it. All right, steps, you're good. <laughs> no one's dying with the spikes today. Uh, and you're, uh, the floor behind you is falling. Okay. Yeah. Uh, as you're walking across, you're you're fine, and that was I'm safe. You're safe. Am uh, I to the other side? You're to the other side. Woo! Um, Acceptable outcome. Uh, Wes, let's go to finish on you. Uh, again, I'm I'm holding my vine whip yes. at the ready just in case. Uh, Twelve plus what is it? Acrobatics three, fifteen. Fifteen. Uh, the floor under you starts to crack. Yeah. Give me an acrobatics check. Uh, Eighteen. 18. Oh. All right, you're just 86. nimbly through it. Yeah. My goodness. Yeah, we're getting lucky here. Five. Yeah. Five. Five more steps, so that's 11. Uh, all right, your last, your last l little effort here. Let me roll against you. <laughs> you made it across. <laughs> <laughs> you get across the bridge. Uh, Mark, you got your, uh, your last few steps. You, you got need, three more feet to go. Uh, do a save. That was quite scary. 12. Yes! Oh! You make it to the last step and you fall through. <gasps> vine whip! Think he called Vine Whip. Oh, he Vine yeah. Whipped you. All, All right, right. Uh, roll you. against AC. Okay. Oh, yay. You might damage her. Nine? Nine. 15. Nine, nine plus. Uh, wisdom's a 12 total. 15. Uh, 12 He's got a 15. So, okay, didn't grab you. Give me a acrobatics check. 16 plus 5. 21. You were able to grab it, you didn't take damage. Woo! Yeah! Woo! <laughs> nice. Nice. And the spell pulls you up. We made it. All the way. Wow, that was dramatic. Can yeah. we wait, wait, wait. Who's the most perceptive? We should check what's on the other side of this bridge. West? I don't want to take another step. I, Those I, traps. Okay, yeah, that was a trap. Uh, we should clearly check for other traps. I'm, gonna, I'm going to look for other traps. Okay. Uh, 19 plus 5, so 24. Oh, yes. Uh, you notice, <laughs> uh, like, engraved on the walls is, is like, tribal design. But as you guys make it across, you see behind you that there's this bridge that's now collapsed with all the spikes down below you, and you are faced with this other hallway. And not all the lights are illuminated yet. It seems as you progress forward, that's when the lights start to light up, and you guys hear uh, a giant roar. Uh-oh. Nope, you hear three giant roars, actually. What? Uh, from the same, from, from the same different creatures, or? or? Uh, they sound, they, they have the same uh, species, is, is the roar. But there's three different, th from three different creatures. You hear three, three different three creatures. Um, would, as a druid, would I recognize what creature was making that roar? Uh, no, it's, it's, it's too old. Mm. It, it's not a, of your, your descent. It's a geriatric. So as character. as you guys heard this, you now hear uh, footsteps fairly quickly. Something's moving down the hall as lights start to light up closer to you. And these three... So these three creatures emerge from the darkness. Uh, they are pale white skin, but look like they have... Um, gills, but it's not gills. What was um, in Game of Thrones? The guy got touched by the thing and then he got like- Oh, grayscale. It's like grayscale. It looks like grayscale. And on their faces are like tribal masks. Um, but again, you don't really know the, the distance. Uh, and they have like tribal markings across their body. Are they bipedal? Are they on four? They're bipedal. With, they're humanoid figures. How, how tall? Uh, these are about six foot five inches. Oh. Ooh, uh, tall boys. And did, did the tribal designs look natural? Like that's Similar how their body the grew? Or is uh, it something that they would have drawn on They would have drawn on them. It's, it looks like for maybe chalk dust. You guys hear a, a voice come in all of your heads. So it's not coming from the creature, it's from the heads. Uh, or it's a voice that you hear inside of your head. And they say that, uh, you hear one voice that says, um, we are the guardians of this temple and you are trespassing. And with that, one of them starts running right at you full speed. How, many, how many are there again? There's three, There's three, and one is running at you full speed. Look, guys, I know I could tell him to stop. I know I have the ability to say halt. I already did that on a horse. And I told the last tiny scorpion to molt before there was a huge scorpion. I'm He's afraid. really gaining. Maybe say No friend. talking, more action. Friend. Say friend. 
Uh, uh, no, there's... instead I'm going to Eldritch Blast as he's running right at his feet. Uh, his feet? Okay, oh, roll oh, a d20. Can I do going that? for it. I'm yeah. going for it. I'm scared, guys. I'm going to Eldritch Blast his toes. That's 18 plus 3, 21. Uh, okay, uh, 21. Yeah, you and Eldritch Blast. And he was, running, he was doing a full dash, mm -hmm. hit him in his feet. By the time it took for you guys to actually talk to him, he got pretty close. The trip happens. He actually lunges forward at you because he's falling. Uh, I need all four of you actually to roll a acrobatics check. But yeah, let's dodge out, dodge out of the way. 22. Seven. 12 plus three. 11. Acrobatics, I 16. have. 16. Um, so 15 for me. 22. I have a plus one in acrobatics. So you're less than 10? Yes. So he falls forward and hits you and you both tumble backwards and you're both now, you're holding on to the, the side uh -huh. and he's holding on to your leg with the spikes way down. Oh the right, road. the pit that was behind <laughs> us. <laughs> Guys, <laughs> help please. I got you. I'd I like to try and kick him in the face and kick him off me into the pit. Give me a strength check. Do it. My natural 20. Yeah, nice. Indeed. Oh, you know, yeah, you, you, oh, uh, hold on. Let me roll against it. Oh, oh no, I'm sorry. No. He's still, wait, 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 15 plus three. 18. 18. 18, 18. All right, I'm strong too. Ah, Tom. damn it. Sorry, can, buddy. Can I take my magic hand? Can I do my magic hand? And I'm going to find this creature's butthole. And I'm going to put my finger right up it real quick. It'll have no idea. <laughs> it's going to be so scared. And it's going to drop its grip so quick. Can yes. I do that? Yes. Yes. Roll a d20. OK. Like, yeah, this is not, yeah, it's a sleight of hand. Not, I'm gonna, not that's attack. the scary. That's going to scare attack. anything. This is just a sleight of hand. Five. Plus a sleight of hand, six. Can I put six fingers up there? No. <laughs> Damn it! Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Finger my butt. Ah! Why though? Because that's gonna make him lose right. his grip. Yeah, uh, he now shakes. Uh, like, he's like, ah! Uh, and and I kick him again. Yes. 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 Woo! Now there's the opening. And he falls that's in his tail. Shotgun becomes shocker. <laughs> and I, I, climb up and, I climb up. Thank you. Combat. Roll for initiative. Sorry, I should go last. I went. Eighteen. Right, roll, roll the three. 15. 19. Well, plus one, so 20. 20. 20, all right. Uh, 15, 19, 20? 18. Mm -hmm. 18, you're? Three. All right, 10. So all that just happened, they're moving towards you. It's not a wide hallway that you guys have, so it's a little bit of uh, a fighting space, but not a lot of fighting space. And they are moving closely. They're walking towards you, not running. Uh, who had the, You had the high one. So I will allow you to use uh, do a strength check. If you pass the strength check, you can get up. And it'll be okay. a free action if you get it. 11, uh, plus strength, plus strength. 14. 14, you're good. You can pull yourself up as a base action and have your turn. Okay, cool. So I climb up uh, and then how close are they? Uh, they're 60 feet walking towards you. Oh, 60? That's way too long for a hand axe. Uh, then I, I I, start winding up the bolus and I, I walk towards them. So you walk I forward walk, 25 feet? Yes, I, would I walk towards them menacingly 25 feet while swinging the axe bola. <laughs> uh, roll Intimidate for me. Okay. Oh, Intimidate. 14. Uh, the Plus two guys kind of look at each other and one, keep two, moving forward. Okay. <laughs> uh, are, are you saying that once they get in range, you'll throw? Yes. If they get in range, I'm going to throw that okay. bowl at them. Uh, second was 18. Well, first off, I'm going to say, does anyone have the ability to attempt to communicate with these creatures? Yes, I do have that ability. Okay. Please try that, and I'm gonna hold my action. Yeah, I'm, hold I'm action. sorry, I just, I'm not feeling it. <laughs> <laughs> I just, look, I've talked to a lot of people before. I talked to that horse, and I talked to the, the scorpion, and they were nice. And this thing did try to kill you. You, you understand yeah. that these creatures might be able to show us exactly where the horn is, right? I, I get that, and I know that I could use, you know, uh, uh, reveal, I could, I could use it, and I could say reveal, I could use This shit. conversation is still happening, but now it's moved on to your turn. They're, because they're getting close. Oh, I said hold, I hold, I'm holding my action. You're holding your action. Uh, you're holding your action for? Uh, it, if they get within 10 feet of us. You will do? Uh, I'm going to use my uh, ice knife. Okay. But I would like to leave room for communication because okay. mm -hmm. I see that there's a sensible I'll opportunity. Think about it. Right. I'll think about yeah, it. I we think already then... killed one of them. I feel like the time for negotiations but, is passed. That one has a, uh, that one out, outwardly attacked us. Uh, I'm going to go to incapacitate this one in order Ooh. to possibly torture it uh, later on wow. for information. information. That's dark. I like that. All right. I want to use my star bat. No, I'm just, I guess. You can take out your star bat right now. No, I, 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 I want to incapacitate this person. Um, yeah, no, I'm just going to walk over. Or I'm, I'm going to run. 
to the uh, to as far as I can go. So thirty five feet. Okay. So he's she's technically in front of you ten feet. Okay. Okay. So while I'm walking, she just kind of jogs past yeah. me. <laughs> yeah. But I'm menacing here. Uh, Trying to menace. You rolled three. Um, okay, my guys now start a sprint. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> They're now doing a fast jog. They're gonna get up to you first, uh, but then you. But you said you're holding to do an ice dagger. Are you still holding for an ice dagger? Because uh, now would be the time to do it before they get too close. It pretty much seems like everyone's going to just kill No, them. dagger one of them. No, I want to torture one. Mm -hmm. Okay, I will dagger I the really one that's a slightly one. further away. Okay. Um, so yeah, I will, ice, I will ice knife that one. Go ahead. Uh, all right. uh, 11 plus 3, 14 to hit. Ah, uh, that's a hit. Okay. Uh, one damage and then dexterity saving throw. For both of them, I'm assuming. Or high dexterity. Uh, that is a 15. Oh, it's the blast is for the second one, too. Uh, you got the second one. Okay, so then 2d6. So that'll be the one moving closest. Yeah, where's the other d6? Uh, 16. So right. it stuck into the one, and then it, it, it like pulled it out and like dodged Exploded. away. But unfortunately, it threw it toward its other friend. It went <laughs> That's <down>. crazy. <laughs> and it for six damage, cool. Uh, so now it's up to it's right next to you and is going for an overhand smash, and it just took six ice damage. It did. This is the one that's taking two. Uh, mm. It's a miss. Oh, it can't. It's too busy being sad. It's wearing a mask. <laughs> that's what it is. Should have taken it so off. So I came up to the horde. For, so it ran up to you with a forward hand smash, and you were able to kind of move out of the way. Uh, but you did have a hold action for when it got close to you, you wanted to punch it. So yes. go ahead and... Uh, I didn't want to punch it. I wanted to use the blunt. hilt of my, of my sword. Ooh, to incapacitate. Yes. Okay, okay that'll give you some bludgeoning damage. The hilt or the... the you said the blunt side. Bl the, the hilt. The hilt. Oh, the hilt. okay. Uh, 18 plus That's a 5. This technically isn't you using your monk weapon. You're <gasps> using it differently. Really? Yeah. So, so I don't have a second hit? Wow. Four. Uh, all right. Uh, that guy just took four damage. Is Do you he, knock you? He like. Is he knocked out? He's not. No, he's not knocked out. Knocked out. Does he seem at all like is that? His, his forward momentum has stopped. Is that the end of your turn? Uh oh no! Because the other one's now you. up to uh, the one that only took one damage. Yeah. Is now running up to you. Oh okay. You now get to make your my, attack. My ready action, yeah, was uh, the bola. Mm -hmm. Ah, fourteen. That's a hit. Plus sweets. No. So I I whip it at, just at his main center of mass. And I'm just trying to, I guess we're trying to incapacitate. We're trying to incapacitate him? Just oh. the one of them. You okay. can kill the other oh, one all right. if you want. <laughs> uh, yeah, I just whip it recklessly at him and see see what happens. Okay, <laughs> um, uh, roll the two damage for your two axes, two okay. short axe damage. Uh, yeah. Oh my. Seven. Wow. All right. Plus three. Uh, so it wrapped around his sides, his leg. Well, we were going for like center mass, so like his oh, chest. Oh, center mass, okay. And for seven damage. And is he is he incapacitated? Is he tied up? Uh, currently yes. Ha! The ex bola. It worked. <laughs> See how? Look, guys, look. See how I wrapped around him and it worked. <laughs> yes, Great we, invention. We tied up. <laughs> Great job. Thank you. <laughs> We're all very proud. Yes. Uh, Two axes in a row. Who knew? All right, you're up. Uh, don't you go. You go before me. I did go. Um, I just got incapacitated. Oh, okay. So you can't move now. At the moment. Okay. Um, and that one's further away. And there's one right now looking at you. Um, I'm going to, uh, the one that's in front of Mari, I'm gonna try to, uh, uh, ooh, I'm gonna Eldritch, bla Eldritch Blast its eyes. I'm gonna try to hit it right in the eyes. Okay. Mm. Jeez. Yeah. We like going for eyeballs over on the side. That's a 14 plus that's three, 17. Okay. And then I roll one damage? D10. Five. Five, all right. Yeah, right in the eyeballs. It, it looks like fire. it's taking some damage. Okay. Nice. Did it break off its mask at all? No. Okay. That's a, it's a hard mask. Well, I wanted to know what was behind there. All right, so I pull out Axie, my double-handed axe, and I'm like, ah, you, so I'm cool to kill this one? You got that other one? Mm -hmm. Okay, you're incapacitated in that one. I'm like, sorry, guy that's all tied up. I'm gonna have to chop you in half. 14. Uh, the other one, as you walk past the other one, gets an opportunity attack and hits you for uh, three damage. No! Oh, why? <laughs> what was incapacitated? Not the other one. I thought you were handling that guy. <laughs> you thought we were. Well, well, I am Sorry. handling uh, that guy. It's not my turn. <laughs> uh, yes, yeah, you still get the attack. <laughs> okay, so 14. That's it. Let's go, Axie. So six plus. 
three slashing damage. For, uh, for nine! So nine, uh, roll a d4 for me. Three. Three, uh, 12 damage. Woo! Wow. So yeah, it's completely incapacitated. I just went up. <laughs> you spit on it first? What? No, I spit on my hands to get a good grip on oh, my hands. Oh, I thought it was on the blade. And then I hack him. But he's got that gray stony skin and it kind of chink. Uh, Mr. Communication? <laughs> what do you want to do? You're up next. I, I, I feel sad about this. These are creatures that I don't quite know and they could be the last I, of their kind. You want to sit out and cry about it? Let's make sure they're the last of their kind. <laughs> yeah. Uh, they said that they're the guardians of the temple and they are protecting uh, the treasure that you want, so. We need that horn. Yeah, you're, you're bounty hunters at this point in time. All right. You, uh, you can grow a consciousness and stay out of battle. That's fine. Hey, it's on you. You've got that ground ability. You can just be in, a, in the floor. I will. It, no, I'm not going <laughs> to leave these all, all these people to die because that would be on, on me. So I'm going, to, uh, I'm going to use my thorn whip on the creature that uh, cruel axes attack. The already incapacitated one? I'll go for the, the second one then, and I will uh, pull that one. So, so 22. Oh, yeah, to, you, you grabbed them. And uh, you're pulling him? 22. Yeah. So 10 feet away. So that guy got pulled this way. Um, and so you, you see it's now standing behind you guys. Uh, and three piercing damage. Three piercing damage. So I'm going to take my sword and put it to uh, one of the, to, to the incapacitated one's neck. And I'm going to threaten the other one to tell us where it is, otherwise I will cut his throat. All right, uh, roll intimidate for me. Wow, I like that. Mm, not very intimidating, am I? Mm, it's a three. Uh, Might not speak their language. Uh, there's no reaction from either one of them. Okay, so can I slit its throat then? Uh, technically, you just did your action. Mm. <laughs> you used your um, to I will, from where I'm standing, I'm going to uh, cast my mage hand, um, and I'm going to cast it and push it up to the butt of your sword, <laughs> up to the creature's neck, and I'm going to slap the back of your sword. Can't use it to make an attack. <laughs> it's, it's, not not attacking. Attacking. it's not attacking. Uh, I'm just hitting the sword. Uh, give me a strength check, <laughs> Mari. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, so you did. Wait, what did you roll? One. Okay, yeah, so it works. Yeah, I really flung it uh, out. And it goes it. right wow. into his throat. And as it pierces his throat, uh, it. Mari drops uh, it. No, the, uh, the thing crumbles. The creature? You didn't actually, like, it wasn't attacked. Nothing really bad happened. You just, you were completely weak and caught off guard, so it pushed mm -hmm. as hard as it could push gotcha. into him. Mm -hmm. uh, really and the incapacitated <laughs> guy is, is dead. Is gone? Okay, cool. And I'm like, did I do that? <laughs> Just uh, a, yeah, it's okay, you. Yeah. Uh, my turn, uh, seeing <laughs> you, he's <laughs> going to back grab to and pick you up. Okay. Oh, it's a straight check. Uh, damn it. Come on, what's the point <laughs> of having bad guys that they can't do anything? <laughs> uh, he's grappling with you now. Oh, uh, okay, so I'm being grappled. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and is it my turn? Uh, it's at <laughs> top of initiative, so, uh, no, it goes laser coin now. Yeah. All right, so he's grappling with this guy? Mm -hmm. Uh, get him, Sky! I believe in you. <laughs> Passes turn to. Uh, I shout encouragement. Okay. Uh, I will give I you a plus one to the next one. As a, as a right, warrior right. dwarf, I don't want to take away the honor of his one on one combat that he's engaged <laughs> his in. His cheers make you feel like you can accomplish something. You get a plus one to your, whatever your next roll is. Perfect. Wait, okay, you're not perfect. gonna kill this guy, right? We need information. I wasn't planning on killing anyone. <laughs> okay. <laughs> to be a hundred. But as he's grappling, you guys are having this conversation. Yeah. I wasn't planning to kill anyone. Okay, I want to torture this one. All right. Somehow, some hand came through and killed the other one. I wasn't meaning to kill that one, uh, but I, it got I just killed. Attempt so. to hold my ground. So uh, then, give me a strength check. So that, grapple. Uh, thirteen. Uh, I pick you up over my head and I start walking towards the pit of spikes. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, I, I guess I'll, I'll sprint over and um, you know what? I'm just gonna use an unarmed strike, uh, and just punch him, punch him in the face. Uh, he's walking away from you. You won't get a face shot. I'll give you opportunity. Oh, he's walking. Go for the back of the head. You'll have advantage. Back of the head. And yeah, you can hit him forward, but again, forward momentum. He's walking him towards spikes. Be careful. How close is he to the spike? He's close. He's close? Yeah. Okay, so then uh, I just take him by his throat and yank him back. Is that, uh, is that a, all right, is that a, it's not, no, no. No, that'd be a, strike. you're doing a strength check. Plus your strength. Seven, 10. 
Uh, I shake it off as I'm moving him closer to the... I'm now about to be at the pit. <laughs> um, mm. Over to Deborah. <laughs> is it, it's my turn? Uh, yeah. Before you get to the pit? Oh shoot, how do I stop you from getting in the pit? Um, because I've, I've, I'm still at the, the front, so I'm near the pit, correct? Uh, my location. He's been walking towards me this whole time. I've yes. necessarily moved, I've been using yeah. spells. So am I in front of him? You're a little off to the side. Okay. I would like to acrobat jump in front, facing him, because because uh, he's got my dwarven friend up yep. above his head like no, this. No, the oh. druid. He's got the, the druid. Oh, druid. he's got. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Sky is in the air. Uh, so I jump up with my acrobats oh. <laughs> and I strike with my dagger into one of the arms here. Okay. Uh, give me an acrobatics check first because you're okay. jumping. Jumping. I jump up with a 14 plus three, Okay, 17. you jump, yeah, you get to that height and now uh, roll for that dagger. Rolling for the dagger attack, that's a, a seven. Uh, a total seven? Mm -hmm. That one missed. All right, well, luckily I've also got Lil Debbie. In my <laughs> yeah. And with Lil, Lil Debbie, Debbie, I strike trying to take out the elbow one more time, hoping that this will cause the creature to drop uh, You aren't that high anymore, you'd have to go for a leg. Okay, well, as I drop down using the extra weight of my force, I slam right down on the creature's toes. Okay. Oh, I think nice. it'll stop him in, in place. Give him that instep. 15 plus 3, eight, uh, 18. That's, that's a hit. Um, to do give three me damage. an acrobatic check. 8. 8. All right, uh, <laughs> so he didn't see you. You had complete stealth on him. Uh, so as you hit his foot, he's fell on over you, falling into the pit once again. And now here we are with, uh, you didn't roll past the 10, so you're both holding on to the ledge. And he's looking at you, and he, uh, he makes a swipe while holding one hand on the ledge and one hand towards you. Uh, do, a, do a roll of strength? Eight. Eight? Oh, no. Uh, yeah, so you, you're taking damage while you're, you're holding on there, and you lose, you lose a little grip. Uh, you're taking two damage, and uh, you lost a little grip. So I can see him peering over the ledge, right? Ish, you, uh, you're far enough where you only see the one hand and two hands. So he's got the, the he monster has- He has one hand, monster has two hands. So I can only see the hands? Yes, until you run close. Okay, yeah, I dash up to try and grab him. Okay. Pull him back up. So yeah, you run the extra speed. Uh, give me a strength check. Uh, okay. Roll a d20. Eight plus five. Yeah, you, uh, you, you pull him up. Oh, sweet! Oh. Aha. Thank, you. Yes, Thank yes. you, friend. Yes. Uh, Very disappointed in your in your fighting abilities. Wait, yeah. wait where's the monster now? Still, Still on the ledge. Okay, I think I'm gonna uh, stab to my my sword through his hand so he can't necessarily let go. Okay. Uh, roll with the with that. Just that's the, the normal attack against my my AC. Uh, sixteen. Sixteen. It's a hit. Uh, you want it specific? All right, it goes through my hand. You don't hear him roar. Hmm. That's a good sign. That's uh, it. it. I it, don't it, know. It I'm doesn't seem to be feeling any pain. Well, Should we be worried about this? Oh my God. Um, Can I still ask turn, him questions? His turn, uh, with his other hand, he reaches for your leg. Mm. Uh, roll a acrobatics check. 15. He reached for you and it didn't work. Hey, hey, Ooh. quick feet. <laughs> I take out a torch, I light it. I take my magic hand and I take the torch down underneath the monster's bottom and I slowly am burning him alive, roasting him, waiting for my friends to, to maybe interrogate this monster right, or let he's, it he's, go. Uh, Ooh, he doesn't uh, like it. Uh, doesn't like heat. Doesn't uh, like butt stuff. The, the, yeah, the none most, of them do. They don't it's like the butt stuff. It's their weakness and I know it. <laughs> uh, you weren't close enough. Uh, all right, the top of the thing here. Oh, back to me? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, ask yes. Him, ask him, ask him questions. Hey, uh, do you know where the horn is? <laughs> <laughs> um, you hear a voice inside of your head. Uh, the horn is not for you. It's not for anyone you're trespassing. All right, I think we've gotten all we can get out of him. I swing at his arm. Okay. Oh, <laughs> my God. God. 11 plus yeah, five. That's, that's a hit. Are you 16. aiming for the fingers? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he Chop his fingers off. Yeah, it got him and he fell ah! off and fell into the spikes. Another kill for Krulak! Big doing! Yeah. Great job. Uh, so you guys get you guys are safe, but you're fine. But well, let's do a uh, health check. You haven't made those other potions yet. Uh, no, I have the supplies for them. Uh, I've lost two HP. 
Do you want to make those potions right now while you're walking through the corridors? You're now moving further in. I'm That's giving you an option. You're making it while sure. you're walking. Okay, yes. I'll make, it while, I'll make it while I'm walking. DM's giving you a... All right, a, I'll make two potions. So right, should I roll two, two d8s? Do, yeah, two d8s. All right. Five and seven. Okay, so you have so you still have the first one, so two, five, and seven. Uh, three, five, and seven. Yeah. Three, five, and seven. Three potions. Um, great, you guys. Oh, and I uh, I retrieve my bolus from the yeah. the guy. Uh, right. Yes, uh, technically very easy because it collapsed, so you yeah. got it. So you have your potions. You guys are making it through uh, some of the tunnels. Uh, once there's some hallways, they find All right, so you guys are now coming across a. So you're kind of winding. It seems to be like snake-like tunnels that you're going through, and. You guys here find, uh, you, you find, you come across a crossing. All right, so as you're coming through, you've walked down a hallway, and down this hallway is a pedestal on it. And on this pedestal, <gasps> it's the it's Lord of Calimort! Is a great axe. <gasps> an axe, you say? Uh, a great yes, axe? Yes, it's an axe. It's a great axe. It sits okay. on this pedestal. Is it? it it's how cool big looking. Is, how big is this? How tall? Uh, if you would like to roll perception. Yes, I, I oh want to check God. out this axe. Of course you do. <gasps> twenty. Not oh twenty. Oh my Not God. Twenty. 20. You my, my axe uh, appreciating skills. <laughs> your uh, your eyes go big <laughs> knowing there's an axe in and here. And sees everything. Uh, you you it. see that it's perfect steel, uh, and the handle has uh, fire, like fire symbols, <gasps> like flames inscribed on can, the sides. Can we see what, uh, there's anything else in this room? Is there another path? Uh, you're just room? in a, in a like a, you're in a hallway and there's a pedestal in the center of this hallway. You still need to be going forward. Um, uh, so there's still just the one way to go. Okay. Not yet. Leave the ax for now. I ignore him and grab the axe. Oh, do you grab the axe? <laughs> wait, 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 hang on. Wait, it's so wait. You'll get the axe. Wait, hang on. I wait. I've seen this in a play once. <laughs> All right. I take I take Axie, my axe, and I very carefully I I quickly switch uh, his the, the the axe that was there with my old axe, yes. and I take the axe. Yes, uh, I've seen this play. Any strength checks to try wait, and stop wait. him? No. Uh, I would like to try and stop him. No, no, stay away from me. I'm stronger than you. Four! I didn't stop. Yeah, you didn't stop. Uh, You're holding him back, <laughs> but his love for axes takes over. Get off me, axe. Uh, and you, so you didn't do a, a perception check on the for trap hunting or anything, just you saw the axe. Okay, yeah, perception for trap. Oh, no, you've already, you've already oh, got right, it. Too yeah, yeah, it. Okay, I did yeah, the axe. So you, you switched it, and then nothing happens. Papa's got a new axe. Oh, okay, axe. cool. So I have the new axe. Do I, what's the new stats for it? Uh, it's the same as the great axe. As you feel it, you are infused. Uh, with the power of flame, and you actually have um, da -da 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 -da, across the uh, oh, that's what it is. When you attack and hit with it, so it's the same stats as the great axe, mm -hmm. but when you hit, you roll an extra d4 for fire damage. Oh, that's no. But you only get to do that 12 times before the uh, magic, magic is depleted up. from that item. That's awesome. Sweet fire axe. Um, Very cool. Very cool. are you leaving right. the axe there? Uh. Yes, I leave that the other. What well, can I carry both axes? Yeah, you're a strong dude. Wait a minute, wait a minute. <laughs> but you put one down and nothing happened. The stats are the same. Leave it there. Leave Just it, please yeah, leave it there. Leave it there for now. Please. You know what? Actually, take it. <laughs> take it. I, actually, no, take I, it. we'll get the axe. You'll get the axe back if we just walk into the next hallway. I will grab it for you. Oh, okay. Oh. Uh, all right. That sounds good. Okay. We walk into the next hallway. Uh, so as you continue to walk, um, once you make it about five to 10 feet away from the pedestal, where the pedestal was kind of based in, the ground there actually sinks in a little bit. And perception checks? Yeah, perception checks. 12. One. 16. Oh man, you were just walking oh really, really happy. One. You're fine. <laughs> la, 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 la. Okay, so okay. Wait, what did everyone else roll? What's your, what's your perception at? All right. Uh, you kept walking. You didn't stop. Wait, did uh, you add your perception? He he rolled oh, a one. I got. I just got a one. Oh, so you got two. A one. you're oh, walking straight, so forward blissfully unaware. Nine, you guys are all high. 12. You guys stop because you hear a giant cracking sound from behind you as the the corridor that you just walked down uh, starts to collapse in as a giant boulder comes down and starts rolling your way. I, I have seen this in the I play. knew it, yeah. <laughs> I um, knew it. I suggest running fast. I still vine with his axe. Okay. Okay. 
I find Whipping's axe and pull it to me as I'm running. <laughs> now I'm running. Uh, out. give me a strength check. Uh, uh, 17. 17? Okay, yeah, you get it. And, and nice. as you're running the... the <laughs> <laughs> what is this boulder made of? Is uh, it ground? Uh, it <laughs> is <laughs> stone. So the boulder's Ooh, behind us. So the boulder's behind us? Yes, and it's now coming down the same long corridor, so it's just We're, rolling fast. Okay, yeah. does yeah. the path branch? No, it yeah. just keep what you had. You, you can't see any option, other options except for running Perception. forward. Okay. Is there earth or dirt in this hallway? Uh, just also. a lot of the stone that everything's made oh, out crap. of. Oh, yeah. okay. crap. All right. Uh, yeah, you keep running and perception check. Look for a side passage or something. Yeah, uh, what'd you roll? Eight. All right. Perception eight. check. Plus, oh, I have a three in. 17. 17? Yeah, look for another way. 11. 15 plus, 15 plus plus. Uh, you're you actually don't count because you don't even know any of this is happening. Oh, you yeah. rolled like sh uh, you didn't roll well earlier. Uh, we push uh, you along. As Run! You, as you guys are running, you actually see that there's an opening that's about to come on the side. Uh, oh okay. So uh, that's that. You guys got to keep on running. Let me. Roll. I'm gonna grab Deb because Deb does not know. This, so <laughs> gonna, uh, thank you. <laughs> oh, oh, right. the back of the guys, chair. bad news. The boulder rolled an 18. Yeah, the boulder <laughs> rolled an 18. Uh, everyone, uh, roll uh, endurance. 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 17. Okay. Constitution 14 plus 2 16. Uh, so 17 plus 14. three 20. 20. Okay, uh, you guys are really close to, to that edge. Uh, one last roll. Uh, 17, roll that same check again. All of us? Uh, no, you're being carried. Okay, thank God. <laughs> Ooh, I only got a seven. Oh, jeez. Wait, are we uh, adding plus, something? Plus three constitution. Uh, your constitution. Constitution? Or an eight. Oh my gosh. Why'd eight. you pick me up? I don't know. <laughs> three. You roll three? Uh, all three of you have stumbled. You're not prone, you just stumbled. Okay. And it's getting okay. closer. Oh. Okay. Uh, Did I make it to the passage? You made. Wait, what'd you roll? Uh, Thirteen. Yeah, you made it to the passage. Woo! So you're looking at your friends there. Do you come on! Uh, I. Uh, you just said come on. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I don't go. Uh, yeah, I go back. Pull the roll of three. Pull the roll of three. Yes. Go back and try and get the nearest one. Okay, nearest one would be him. Okay. Come on! Oh, right. So you pick him up. up, so you get to continue running. You're okay. good. You guys need to roll. Uh, she needs up. to roll because I'm on oh. her back. Well, no, you're on the ground now. Oh, she dropped me? You, you both oh, oh my gosh. Okay. okay. What are we rolling for? 11. Constitution. 13 total. 16. 16? 13. 13 and 16? You should have stayed <laughs> on my desk. I couldn't, you dropped me! <laughs> uh, as you make it on, you're no. falling behind because your legs are still a little stumpy. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And as you're about to jump, the boulder hits your side <gasps> uh, and pushes you in towards them as it <laughs> Oh my by. god, but that's, that's a train wreck on my body. You take four damage. Oh my gosh, oh. my little gnome oh. form. Oh. The poor little guy. Wow. Um, but as that boulder <laughs> came crashing down and through, it was just collapsing the ground. Kind of like how dominoes kind of crash uh -huh. when they're going through, so you can't go back mm -hmm. that way. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. But did it make more of a path where it went? No, no, yeah, it just kept it going down. In. Yeah, cool, cool. And uh, now we're so you guys see path. this hallway? You guys are walking down this hallway now. Mm -hmm. uh, the lights are illuminating. Uh, let me get everyone to roll. Uh, uh, actually, you guys are just walking through. Okay. My uh, legs still work, right? Uh, yeah, they work. They're okay. They're All right, good, okay. good, but <laughs> since we've been running into a lot of traps, I'd like to check for traps as we continue forward. Ten. Plus, what, my perception? So, 13? Mm. 21. 21. Uh, your elf eyes don't see anything. You don't oh, see okay. any issues. I think we're okay. Oh, oh it's yeah. not no. the magic, I'm scared. Just like you thought that guy wasn't I, poisoned. Just for a double check, <laughs> I would also like to do a perception check. I rolled a 22. Uh, just a double check. What did you roll? 21? 21. Yeah, you, you, yeah, this room looks fine. Okay. And at the end is, uh, is like a, a, a giant door. Okay. Right. I don't trust your elf eyes. For some reason, I feel like the elf eyes are what's going to ruin, uh, walk us into a trap. But let's see what's going to happen. All right. Uh, okay. Um, you guys are walking fall. through. Everyone roll a dexterity save. Eight. Seventeen. Twelve. 20. Natural twenty. Oh, yeah, nice. 20. You're twelve. Eight. A you're an eight. All right. Uh, you, you're beat up. So as you two are walking next to each other. You feel a uh, click underneath your feet, but it's not a physical click. Click. It's more like a magical movement mm -hmm. of uh, the floor under you. I need both of you, uh, because it starts to slide open, give me acrobatic checks. Oh, God. Ooh. Why did I have to break my legs? Two. 
Oh, two. I also five. rolled a two. I have five total here. Jeez. We both have five. Uh, yeah. Okay, you guys see them falling backwards as they start to scream. Yeah, I jump and try to grab the nearest one to Give me. Give me a, both of you roll a strength check. Seven. Four. Jeez. Oh, wait, uh, what, plus what with your, with your strength? Oh, pl uh, yeah, I have a strength of five, so nine. <laughs> I uh, ah, I've been mind whip. Roll against his, uh, roll against him. 14. 14. 14. All right, so you didn't break Plus his three. AC, so you won't hurt him. Uh, give me a uh, sleight of hand check for you. Okay. Nine Ten. plus. Okay. So 11. 11? Yeah. Uh, all right, you've grabbed onto the rope and you didn't take damage. Uh, give me a sleight of hand check. Oh, God, sleight of hand. Grab my leg. Jeez. Ooh. Oh, 16, 17 total. All right, great. You've held on to him, you've held on to him, <laughs> and you missed. <laughs> yes. Uh, oh so God. now you pull them to safety. Okay. Ooh, hee ho. We're alive. Uh, and We're alive. what you saw there was like the, the floor Thank very you, instantaneously friend. just lowered and moved out from underneath mm -hmm. as if there was never floor mm -hmm. air at all. Mm -hmm. uh, and you guys look below and it just looks like a never ending pit. Mm -hmm. See, I knew I shouldn't trust your elf eyes. <laughs> Look, physical. No one check for magic. Yeah. All right. Uh, do you guys go through the door? Uh, yeah. We all yeah. go through holding hands carefully. The, the door is the only way. Yeah, I think forward. we should yes. hold hands. Yeah. Okay. You guys can hold hands. Yeah. Sure. Cool. We're gonna. Behold. I mean, it's a little weird, but okay. All right. Uh, Lions and tigers and bears. Oh my. You guys <laughs> enter this room. More lights enter around you, and you see a chest in the. Uh, it's a wide. It's a much wider room. And uh, you see a chest in front of you and a door in the back. I oh, think we should just exit. Perception. I say, screw the chest, <laughs> go for the Perception egg. check for uh, traps? Yeah, roll for it. Uh, that would be a 24. Uh, for traps, do you, you see no well, traps? Okay. Perception I'm looking, check I'm looking around for the magic. Just like, I, uh, if it would, you can roll a magic check if you'd like. Arcana check? Four. Four. Uh, oh, eight total with my Arcana. Uh, you sense no magic. As oh a warlock, you would be able to sense good and evil in here. You don't sense anything. I sense nothing, guys. I All right. Know. Well, the last, I mean, I already found a fire axe. Maybe the chest has an ice axe in it. I'm opening the chest. <laughs> no, we want the horn. We want it to be oh, a yeah, horn. Oh, yeah, the horn. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah the horse. You can yeah. buy all of the axes you want That's with 10,000 yeah. All right. I'm do I need to roll anything? Or no, no, you can open I go over and I open the chest. All right, and as you open the chest, uh, you look down and it just looks like it's hollowed out into the ground as a giant hole. Uh -oh. And you see these two tiny little green eyes kind mm. of uh, peek through. And then a bunch of other little green eyes start to peek through as these beetles start to grow, uh, crawl out of the chest um, and uh, start to like just so many of them just start to come yep. out of the chest. Right, I, I run away. You run away? <laughs> you didn't close the chest, you close run away. Chest, oh, I'm sorry, close the chest. Close the chest. Um, I close the chest. So as you step away from the chest and you close it, it's actually just getting filled up with more and more bugs and it pushes the chest top up and uh, the chest then breaks uh, to its sides around you. You idiots made me waste final time closing the chest. <laughs> Did nothing. As these uh, beetles, uh, if, if, would you like to roll a nature check for me? 20. Uh, oh. Okay, you see that they have razor sharp uh, like um, pincers, uh, and the size of them, they don't look like they just eat like rocks and mineral. They look like they eat flesh. Yeah. Flesh burn it with beetles. fire! Burn it with fire! I saw this, I saw this in a play once about a mummy. Yeah. Let's go. I'm starting four torches, and I want to hand them to my friends. All right, uh, all of you holding torches. I'm okay. you guys torches. Wait, wait, wait! He's got a fire Shish axe. Back. Use it. Oh right! It's oh. gonna use. 12. Yeah. No, it, it's uh, when you do damage, you can do fire damage. I'm, it doesn't I'm ignite. one little beetle? No, I'd rather just use my hand axes. I'm not going to waste that. Okay. Are you, so you're not holding a torch? Well, I ran away. Uh, I guess no, I grabbed no, a you, torch. No, you closed and take a few steps back, so okay. you're now all together. Okay, yeah, I'll like grab a torch. torch. Okay. Uh, yeah, I uh, grab a torch and take sky. a swing. Oh, sorry. Go. You're taking a swing at the pie? Yeah, pie? At, the, at the beetles. 14. All right. You, back beetles! Yeah, you swing along the ground and like you see that they kind of react differently to it. Okay. Uh... I, what, did I hit any of them? Uh, no, there's just, it's a mountain of these bugs that have now kind of formed their way uh, around you and there's just no way to get past them. You guys are like the four of you here, back to back, and they are just Everywhere. all over you, just all around, surrounded Remember all that you. time you stepped on a cat-sized scorpion? Yeah, I did, but there was only like four of those <laughs> things. <laughs> I could try jumping into this pool mm. of pile of beetles. Um, do we have any way of making the fire bigger? Nope, someone didn't get bonfire like yeah. I asked. Okay. Can you just 
put them in the ground. Just. Ah, uh, this is stone. This is all stone. It's stone. I hate stone. I also don't like it. <laughs> um, it's if, cold on the feet. If they all. Oh, something's they're happening. They're getting a little closer. Mm. They're, they're if being they less all afraid of interact the fire. with each other, if I were to command one to mate, do you think all of them would then mate and we would have enough time to possibly get to the exit? Uh, nature check? Five. Uh, they're asexual. They're asexual. <laughs> oh. Um. I have a dumb idea. I like, I like your... Ooh, ooh. I would like to use my thorn whip and light it on fire with one of the torches and swing it at the bugs. Okay. Uh, All right. Uh, it, it, it's, it's successful. Thorn, thorn it's... whip, and I just whack a bunch of the bugs in the path to the, the next entrance, and I just yell, run! Uh, <laughs> no, there's, there's, you're so like many. sweeping them away. Yeah. Okay. They come back. Can, can yeah. I do it while I, while we move? It's not effective. Uh, is there anything on the ceiling? Or Too high. Higher than 30 feet? Yeah. Oh. You're in a clearing. You're now near the center of the, uh, the temple where you saw it stacking. So you're now near the center. Is, oh, I'm out of ideas, everyone. I have an idea. Is the past room still there? Yeah. Yeah. The door's still open. Look at me. You marry that king. <laughs> you murder him and you become the king. You. Yes. Why are you saying Find it like Gary. this is goodbye? Make sure Gary still has my little, my little Jimmy Debra. I will. Yeah. And you. Don't you do this. Yes. I wish you knew a little bit more about these beetles. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you do this. Don't break my heart. I would What's like to command the beetles, beetle, hoping that all will follow the command. I will tell them, follow. No, I will tell them. Die. Tell them to die. I'm going to tell them to come. Oh, no. Don't mm -hmm. do it. And I'm going to use my 25 walking feet. And I'm going to walk in the opposite direction of my friends. You won't, they won't uh, open up for you. What, uh, how tall are you? Do you have like a, a I'm three feet. You're three feet? Maybe someone could throw you or? All right, would you, uh, yeah, yeah. Can you, you have jump. Can Who's, you get tap him oh. with jump? Uh, jump. I cast, I cast jump uh, on, on our little friend. With the super jump, I jump up into the sky. I say, follow. And I and I run oh. out of the room. So you jump over them. I jump over them into as the I cast room. my spell into the past room. Okay. Running all 25 feet the opposite direction from you, my friend. You technically can dash 50. Yeah, and then I dash 50 feet. Oh, no. Although that might take me. You know the floor disappeared back there. That's what I was about to say. Okay. Um, but you know what? All, uh, by the way, uh, all the, they're following you. They're, they're following coming, they're me. Coming towards you. I'm oh going to jump in the air. I cast. I tell the beetles. I command them follow, and I, I dash off the cliff. Whip, whip, whip him down whip the him. floor. Whip him. Uh, he he dashed. That's more than thirty feet. <laughs> <laughs> He's fifty feet. I oh I God. did dash willingly, and I look at all of you, and I cast my magic hand as I fall off the edge. And I give a wave. No. A no, shotgun. No. 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 All the bugs follow you down that hole. Oh, <laughs> he no. saved us. He saved us all. Oh my Am God. I, I'm, I'm done. Do I get a roll or did I sacrifice uh, it, myself? It, 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 that worked. It's a never. -ending. You are not here currently. Oh. I'm in fall. Oh my I'm God. Fall. I just got chills. It's a fly, you fools moment. Fly, you fools. There's a door on the other side. We should open the door. <laughs> I'm gonna run up and check and see if I can see it. Yeah, you, you, uh, with your dark vision and your elf eyes, it just looks like a never-ending drop. You don't even hear the bugs anymore. <laughs> There's a no, saying among our people at times like this. Press Ukala, Danar, Canada. And it means the man with three axes weeps, <laughs> for he has only two hands. <laughs> it always makes my people feel a little better at times like this. Anyway. Uh, uh, as they say in the Milfwood Forest, 
Press F in the chat. <laughs> uh, All right, let's get this horn. All right, three-way you, split. So you guys have three-way split. <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh, okay, uh, you wow. guys open this door and you see a, a staircase, mm -hmm. a stone staircase up. Um, and at the very top of the staircase, like on the ceiling above the top, you actually see like this kraken statue uh, mm -hmm. made of stone. That's like, and its tentacles are coming down to an altar. You can't see what's on the altar yet but there's stairs in front of you. So, let, I mean, maybe the horn's on the altar. Let's go get it. Uh, yes, I, I suppose I want to take a second for our departed friend. Oh, did we not do that? Okay. <laughs> yeah. I'm actually still falling! <laughs> <laughs> I heard him, yeah, it's like a bottomless pit. Um, technically, maybe it's you like still a have portal thing? Technically, you still have super jumps, start jumping off the walls. Uh, <laughs> you, you have, uh, so he's, he's slowing down because of consciousness. Are you running up the stairs? Oh yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm going to see what's okay, on. You're the taking altar. charge. Are you going up the stairs? I'm running. Okay, we, you guys we, can, the stairs? we can move during a moment of silence. We yeah. just have to be do it quietly. Uh, are you following up the <laughs> stairs or are you still okay? Stairs. You following up the stairs. Slower. As you make it up to the top of the stairs, you make it. You, you're going for a while. It feels like you're going like three stories or mm -hmm. something to the top of this altar. And as you make it to the top step, you do see the altar, the stone cracking with its tentacles coming down and laying right there is a pristine looking horn oh. of Calamon. We found it, the horn of Calamon. Yes. I grabbed the horn. But as you take the step onto the pedestal, you look across and you say, Tiffany? And that's where we're ending the episode. Ah. Guys, uh, exciting cliffhanger we ended on here. Uh, be back next week for the exciting conclusion. Yeah, so hey, about that join us next week thing. See, we filmed these videos uh, before the coronavirus outbreak, um, intending to release these first four on each of our channels, uh, Jovan and I, and then uh, while they were being released, film more episodes uh, so that we didn't leave you guys on a cliffhanger. Unfortunately, uh, you know, uh, the coronavirus has changed things up a little bit, and uh, and so there will be... Unfortunately, uh, no conclusion next week. Um, I'm not sure when we can all get together and shoot again, but I'm hoping it's soon. Uh, but probably not till after the quarantine, which ends, oh my gosh, uh, in May, I think. Sometime in May. I, I thought about suggesting, you know, maybe we should shoot on Discord or something, or all from separate places, like quarantine episodes. But I just thought it would lose that magic of us all being in the same room and stuff, and we've been having a lot of fun with it. So, uh, yeah, so no, uh, no episode next week, but maybe we'll have something for you, something D&D related um, on Friday. We're, uh, I'm still working that out. Um, but thank you to everyone who has followed this little adventure. I hope you all staying safe, uh, staying, you know, staying put at home, washing your hands, doing all the things you're supposed to do. And yeah, we're going to get this back rolling again just as soon as, you know, safely possible. So uh, thanks for your patience. And uh, there will be more videos on this channel. So this isn't a blackout or anything. It's just a temporary hiatus for the D&D &D series. All right. See ya. Whenever we do get the next episode up, it will be located right over here. But for now, it's just going to be kind of a random button. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you'll know when this starts up again. And hey, uh, have you seen uh, Jovin's series that kind of runs concurrent to this one? You might want to check that out. It's right over here.